So here we are with our second match of the day, Dom G versus Final Fantasy. D, remember uh, extra time and penalty. Oh yeah, thank you. Welcome. We have to book a table of penalties. Do we also put it up to four subs? Uh yeah yeah we want yeah. four. We'll yeah because extra time yeah. Extra dime. Extra dime. There you go. Sub by ability, okie doke. There you go. No metals got subbed off. What, you mean this isn't rigged? What is this? <laughs> there you go. Um, FFG are on a combination of a paste bin and phone posting, so. <laughs> Good yeah, job. I've, Good. I, I, I've been there, done that. Um, <laughs> You know, it is nice to have a to have a have a pace bin for for the streamer in case uh, yeah. know, something goes wrong. Especially especially when you're in a situation where you can't. I mean, we don't have the recam today, but when you're on delay due to uh, yeah, it's still a busted. I, don't know, I should probably talk to Marco about that. Oh, uh, damn it, Marco! <laughs> yeah, I don't know. I get maybe the URL that he uses expired or something. Mm -hmm. I don't know. Uh. That's it for FFG for the pace bin anyway. Uh, looking at the conditions, some, uh, preset two and then sub by ability. All right, there you some go. Good conditions there for their uh, defense. Who needs a midfield? Damn right. <laughs> DMF and the CMF. That's all you need. All right, does that look correct to you, uh, Dom G? It is a pretty unorthodox formation. Dumb G. A 5 2 3. Beautiful. <laughs> <laughs> Looks good. All right. Anything else for you, Dom G? I've got your, um, got your stadium. I put in an elephant ball. Because why not? And, I mean, yeah, this is like an export edit thing that you need to fix on your own. If you advance from today, you can ask somebody how to fix it. It's not that hard. You just need to know exactly what to change. The model, you mean? Uh, it's like a kit thing. It's like in the, mm. yeah, the way the chest and the legs are missing and all that. That's all stuff you have to yeah. fix with your players in your edit, in your export. It's invisible. The character is actually uh, partly invisible. <laughs> all right, let me get the music. And we're ready to be ready to go. Dom G and FFG. There we go. Connect to Senpai. Alright, let's kick it off. Dom G versus FFG. Did you know only one team has earned two stars since the founding of the VGL and they're dead? Rip it. What team is that? That would be D and G. Oh. Good old Yu Gi Oh! Well, you know. Uh, maybe someday that will change. Wink, wink. All right, here we go. Have some anthems.
All right, and here we go with Dom G kicking off. Hey, they have Dr. Jugal up front. <laughs> Round elves never relax. Here's Heroic Obesity getting tackled by Square Enix Joshua. But Dom G managed to get the ball back only to lose it and then get it back. All right, well, we didn't really do this in the le last match, but uh, who do you think is going to come out on this as a foul happens? Um, I'm going to go with um, I'm gonna go with FGG. Um, I think that uh, I think that Dom G's unorthodox formation may uh, be their undoing here, and uh, I'm going to go with the more well, more traditional one. Useless FGG. kick oh. kicks uselessly. I think we didn't do that in the last match because, um, it was you know, like, um, yeah, you came in after the anthem. Yeah, I came in late, and they were they were down. Um, uh, he was down. Yeah. <laughs> um. They're the underdog. Well, Dom G traditionally have always been meme lords. They play weird shit every time. Usually doesn't work out for them, but mm -hmm. on occasion it has. I mean, they're here to the survival round, so it's true it worked to them enough. Um, I mean, both teams here, if we look at the teams, FGG's defense has been extremely stout. Only conceded uh, two goals in the group stage. However, they only scored two goals in the yeah. group stage. Well, oh. we, well we look at uh, Domji, Domji's offense has uh, definitely been firing. They've scored seven goals, but they've also conceded six goals. So, what are we going to see here? Are we going to see a, a nil nil snoozer, or are we going to see some goals? Well, here's FFG, ha, 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 loses the ball to Dom G's defense and gives it over to the keeper. I'm not sure. I think whether FFG's manager intended or not, he's created a bit of um, a defensive pre uh, defensive export. Mm -hmm. A bit of a slurper. Yeah. Oh, and, and that's over the bar. Oh. Hi, Louie. <laughs> uh, work, work, work. Or qua. Whichever <laughs> game you prefer. Fat man can't shoot. What a surprise. Fat elephant. <laughs> He's fat! Oh my god, bully! He's fat! I have changes at the half for Dom G if nothing exciting happens. Alright. <laughs> <laughs> you got it! I mean, sure. <laughs> you know? At halftime, if it's nil-nil and we have, like, a minimum amount of shots, I want to see changes. Yeah, fair enough. Anything to get the slurping down. Yeah. Admirable. Some people just keep it that way, just, like, too nervous to make changes. I mean, it's, it's one thing if you're, like, um, the Pez momentum is with the other team. And you, you know, pounded. I mean, at, at, at some point... If you have a good defensive setup, you just want to run that. Yeah. Let's see. Preset three. Okay. Oh, that's not a foul. Oh. Preset three for FFG. There you go. Dr. Jugal loses the ball. Oy vey. Out for a throw in. Another show up. And a yellow card, apparently, for Dom G. It's oh, so there call, was a foul. Yeah. Yeah, there you go. Calling that late. Yeah, I did. I was like, I was like, well, that's not a foul. Well, yeah. apparently, <laughs> it depends. The boomer got it right. <laughs> Jugal is able to keep the ball, trying to find the dragoon in the box, but it's cleared acrobatically. Back in FFG's possession, uh, Manlets, explain you're not catching up to the ball. When will they learn, QD? <laughs> when will they learn? God, never. Like, like, if you're a manlet, you're supposed to be fast. It's part of the rule set. How the fuck do you get catch up to that? This Titus laugh brought to you by Tyrone. Laughing for a thousand aeons. Uh, a warning. I went out for a throw-in. Uh, well, it's a warning, so they'll do a free kick, but... It went out the side. Base Tyrone has uh, has some good messages that I think the uh, SP Janner need, needs to watch. Kind of a <laughs> kind of overdue, but uh, I think I think he would benefit 
and his uh, administrative practices by uh, listening to a uh, bass tone. Pull with me, gets in the way, and Dr. Jugal picks it up. Cuck Dragoon. Coming up, trying to find Jugal. Jugal intercepted a bit by the defender marking him. Useless kick is able to get it over the keeper. Oh, you got fouled after the fact there. I don't know if you saw that. Yeah, it was a pretty nasty tackle, but it was clean, apparently. Gotta watch that instantly. I don't know. He, he tripped him after he, was, he lost <laughs> the ball. It's clean. There's no ball. Like, it's clean. <laughs> I don't know. I, I, you know. There was no ball near them, so it's fine. You can do whatever the hell you want. <laughs> Maybe I don't know what the hell I'm talking Just fucking kick somebody in the face as long as the ball isn't near them. Whatever. <laughs> ha, ha, ha. Trying to find... Uh, squaring is Joshua, I believe. But Dom G is able to get possession of the ball and get it out of their box. Good back heel by the heroic obesity. Useless. That player with like the the YouTube sign over their head. Yeah. I keep thinking that's the ball. <laughs> the ball is, Jesus. is gray though. It's so distracting. <laughs> Forrester Bob gets the ball, gets it over to 16 stale sneak attack. Cut Dragoon trying to pressure, but gets it away. We are definitely slurping a bit. Here's an innovative strategy. Trying to find Blood Gem. Blood Gem with a weak header, but it's off target. The Void grabs oh. it anyhow. The most exciting moment of this half. Um, I, guys, I don't think this Sleem and Slipping Sport is for me anymore. No. Uh, I'm not European enough for this. Yeah. <laughs> uh, Manlets. Doing a throw in over to Josh. Trying to find Cuck Dragoon, caught by the ghosts in a fort. And that's it for the half. Nil yeah. nil. Remember, remember when I said there could be lots of goals, or there could be, uh, yeah, <laughs> yeah. FTG route. Uh, I think we're seeing the, the FTG route. <laughs> yeah, I was leaning towards the FFG route too. I mean, look at this. Look at this. <laughs> Bless their hearts. Dom G are trying. <laughs> Three nil. For shots. Wow. <laughs> oh, Jesus. All right. Well, what would you guys like to do for any changes at the half? Uh, Dom, do you call Please. Some. Please. Something. Please. We're at preset three. Um, would you like to do anything as well, FFG? Okay, that looks better from uh, FFG. I like it. Yeah, they changed that preset three during the first half. Um, nothing in their pace been about changes at the half. But here they come in with their phone posting, waiting to see what... <laughs> okay. All right, Don G, what would you like to do at the half? Also can't take forever waiting for your changes. Do, 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 I will give you 50 do, seconds. Do, 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 Oh, the internet died. Okay, uh, nothing happened. You're nil-nil. <laughs> you got three shots and they're all off target. And then the only shots in the game. <laughs> <laughs> Just move. even halftime is resident sleeper. All right, move the fullbacks up to wing mid positions. Ooh, getting spice. I don't know how far up you want them. I'll put them at the center line, the mid line. Go counter if you're not already on that. You're not, so I will do that. There you go. Is that good, or do you want the um, the wing mids dragged back a little bit? If football wins, can we kill both teams? Uh, that'd be nice, but no. <laughs> <laughs> All right, uh, FFG, anything you'd like to do? Sub to 75 for Dom G. All right. Oh, FFG have decided to go back to preset one and change them to counter long wide flex. Support range six. 
It's time for Lang Bowl. And subs at 70. All right. Looks good. Let's go on to the second half and see if our luck will fare any better. Please. <laughs> Please. <gone>. Thank you. <laughs> All right. Dom G is able to wrestle the ball away. He's over to heroic obesity. Can't get the pass. Oh. He's too fat. He's too fat. Long ball, not very successful. Gets a just finds Earth Snick. And a nice interception by Funga. FFG driving up the wing. Dr. Jugal trying to find the box. And there's a kick by the Cuck Dragoon, but it's into the fence. Burn up time. Coming up the wing. Pressured. Out for a throw in for Damji. We were so close to it. Quality chance. Time. Blood gems actually on target somehow, but the void catches it. So weak, though. It was weak. I'm, I was more surprised. She was like in the complete opposite direction of the goal, yeah. the net. But she still got it on target. <laughs> Mm. FTG are just not connecting on, on these crosses. Yeah, well, that's what long ball do to you sometimes. As we saw with AGDG in the previous match. Mm. <laughs> this is a skeleton champ, but I swear to God, I thought it was slurping at the first. I have my thing muted, but I could hear it through your mic. Yeah, yeah, that'll happen. <laughs> it was hilarious. Yeah, uh, FGG just giving the ball away constantly. Yeah, well, Back. here's Joshua. Joshua is able to keep the ball, trying to find Ha Ha Ha, gets over to Funga, trying to find Joshua. Joshua slips it in! We have a no! goal! Look at him chase after that Nintendo Switch. <laughs> uh, it's 1 0 finally. Finally, we have a goal. It's 62 minutes. We're free. The slurping is done. And there's a save, a shot and a save by Domji. Oh, wow. Yeah, yeah, a huge goal at that. Maybe Apez is starting to open up this game a little bit. But uh, All right, from what we've seen previously, <laughs> uh, I would say it's, it's pretty likely that um, they may have just won the game here. I don't know. Who knows? We have a corner here for Domji. Burden of time. Kicking it over. It depends. Trying to get his head on it. Joshua gets in the way. The Void grabs it off the ground. Void consumes all. Base next death. Base tree man. Changes at 75 out the back for a uh, goal kick, I believe, from the flag. Yep. And here's Dom G coming up the wing, into the center, back to the wing. Burn of time. Blood gem trying to find it. No, it's hooked out for a throw in. 
That's some good rate defending there. Last nice ditch. Get your foot on the ball, get it out. And FFG clear it. Dr. Jugal trying to receive the pass. It's headed down. And we're in the middle line at 70. Uh, FFG wanted, oh, it's 75, they say, uh, instead. We're going to stop at 75 then for both teams. Hooking it over, trying to find Blood Gem. They stop play here, though, for a foul. Oh, God. <laughs> that fat bastard. Well, they have a free kick here. Useless kick, put it back into the box. Intercepted by the defense. Joshua gets the ball. That really was a useless kick. Useless kick gets the ball over to Heroic Obesity. Back to Useless Kick. Heroic Obesity trying to find Blood Gem. Blood Gem heads it and it's caught by the Void. Oh, man. You know, if you believe in meme magic, you probably shouldn't have uh, a player named Useless Kick for your free kicks. Uh, <laughs> you know, just a, just a thought. But it'll be better when he does actually make a good kick. <laughs> <laughs> it's like get good. It's like <laughs> he's never good except when he's good. Then he got good. All right, um, both teams wanted to stop at 75 for both subs, and Domji want changes. So FFG are going to take the fullbacks out. So big. Yeah, I think uh, I think for Domji you you need to grease the wheel a little bit here, to change things up. Bigs and Wedge coming on for FFG, and hold the last. All right. Domji want to move the wing forwards up. Um, oh, thanks. Like so, I suppose. Uh, go to center. Support range five. And turn deep defensive line on. Okay, that's interesting. Sub the wing mids. So we'll have attack. So they have attacking fullback and deep defensive line. They started with fullbacks, remember. They moved oh, yeah. them up I mean, in the wing the, mids. The advanced instructions. I wonder if those... I guess those don't apply to them. Yeah, I don't know what it do. does if you don't have fullbacks. If it does anything. Yeah. And the CMF. Okay, sexy Kululu. 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 There you go. Uh, is that good for you, Dom G? Dom G are good. FFG are typing at me, but they better hurry. Typing intensifies. I know, yeah. Gonna give you about 10 seconds to finish whatever you're typing. There you go. Ah, uh, yeah. All right. They're gonna take a voluntary to put it to short pass again. And centering targets on. There you go. Interesting. All right. That's your lot in life, unless you have something else, FFG. <laughs> I'm on phone poster. They're good. All right. I'll just sit here waiting for the phone poster to finish. Yeah. <laughs> ha 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 with a header, but it's caught by 2,000 ghosts in a fort out of the air. Who's laughing now? <laughs> Burden of time. Looking at way over, trying to find Blood Gem. Blood Gem chasing it, gets it, takes the shot, it's into the void, out for a corner. Just too tight an angle there. It's a good chance. That was One an improvement in that it wasn't just an automatic header out of Blood Gem. Yeah. She actually tried to get the ball and shoot it. It's one of the better chances they've had. She just needed to go a little more center. We have a corner for Domji. Kicking it out. Rogue Obesity just whiffs that header entirely, finds Joshua instead, and it's cleared out. Dom G trying to get that ball back. Blood Gem finds Rogue Obesity. Rogue Obesity puts it off defender for another corner. Dom G are, are pounding it, pounding the wall. We'll see if the FFG's uh, 
the fence can hold, but uh, they're really going for it. We're at just 80 minutes. Oh, wow. We're at neutral mentalities. So that's interesting. Punched away by the keeper and headed away by the defense to get it clear. FFG getting dogged. Domji takes that ball back immediately. Wow. Heroic obesity. Blood jump with a long shot out. Void actually, I believe, Whoa. touched that. What a save. I'm not even sure if that was on target. It looks like it hit uh, the Void's hands. I don't the, know if uh, Void is in the running for uh, the glove, but I imagine on this performance it would at least be. It did, in fact, hit the Void, so we have yet another corner for Domji. Void has is, is really uh, failed F FFG out in this class. Diplo Monster is able to get the ball, but there's some confusion, and they lose it. And FFG are building up the wing. Here's Dr. Jugal. Loses the ball to Earthsneck, and now FFG just can't do anything. Earthsneck's just going to let it... Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Feels bad for FFG, I guess, and just lets it out for a throw-in. And Domji just get the ball back. Oy vey, thank you for the ball, Goin. Boy, buy more gems. The fat elephant puts it out for a throw-in. Good job. He's fat! He's thick. FFG just trying to find their way through. And they just get the ball taken away. They pick it back up. Building up here. Here's Ha Ha Ha. A tackle by Blood Gem. Diplo Monster gets the ball. And it's over to Blood Gem. Heroic obesity on the wing deep. Trying to find Blood Gem again, but can't find her. Oh. That was a good pass That's slotted through defense. defender's legs. In the right place at the right time. They have three minutes. If they want to get anything going, they need to get that ball up now. How are you not on a plus one or plus two? I don't understand. Yeah, they haven't turned on anything. They got to get Ooh. that ball up immediately. They have a minute, less than a minute. Go, go, go. Burn up time. Don't go back. Yeah, you're, nope, the nope, nope. Not they fucked have it. The same urgency. They, they fucked it. Uh, yeah. They were doing too much passy back. They just had to pass it up front, but they didn't do it. Well, and that's the end that of the game. F one nil for FFG. That was an FFG clinic on defending. Um, Domji did have a few chances, but overall, uh, FTT really limited the. Domji was doing good there, especially in the last dying minutes of the game, getting that ball back from FFG in the middle in the midfield. But uh, they just couldn't get anything going. They couldn't find Blood Gem in a favorable position to even take a real shot. And they just kind of f fucked around with the ball in the dying minutes and just... That was it. FFG just held on, and they're through. They will be a tough nut to crack for, uh, for Vita Gen, I would imagine. Look at the 3-3 three, 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 three shots for FFG. Six saves out of the void. 9-6 out of Domji. Every single on-target shot was saved by the Void. You're a man of the match, it's the Void with a 7, of course. Of course! 6-5 uh, for Funga and Joshua for the goal. But otherwise, just a bunch of 6s and 5-5s. Five yeah. And a 5. Well deserved. Match details at 25 minutes. It depends. Got a yellow card. Uh, 62 minutes. Square Enix Joshua from Funga. Then 79 minutes. Subs came on. That's it. Tagging areas. And your ball winning areas. Yeah, there's... Not a lot to say about this match other than uh, FGG um, did uh, did well and uh, got the one really good scoring chance they needed and put it in. Yeah, and that'll do it. FFG move on to the second round against VitaGen. And now we move on to our third match, which is FGOG versus Kirara. And we are going to play the FFG Victory Anthem and move on. Here we go. <laughs> <laughs> 